Welcome into this presentation of Minor League Baseball from the AA Texas League. Tonight, a matchup of teams at opposite ends of the division between the Frisco Rough Riders and the Midland Rockhounds. Standing in, Yoni Hernandez. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. That's lifted the other way out to left. Armenteros is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first out. Stepping in, Eli White, and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Two balls and a strike. Two balls, one strike. Swing and a miss, strike two. Bases are empty, one man in. So a full count now. Game time temperature, a comfortable 76 degrees. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first. But this one lands in the bullpen area, a foul ball. Hit on the ground is short. He's got it. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the error. In now, Anthony Buck. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Sliced hard on the ground. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Vimael Machin. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. That softly hit to right. Will that get down? White onto the grass. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Stepping into the box, Dylan Thomas. He's three for seven in the series coming in. 3-2 pitch. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. The next 3-2. So striding in, George Merritt. First swings for him in this one with a runner still at first and one gone. Swing and a miss on the changeup and there are two gone. Striding into the box, Eric Peralta. He's driven in three runs on three hits so far in the series. Swing and a miss for strike three. Pulled the string on him that time, and the inning is over. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Michael DeLeon. Four hits already in the series through seven at-bats. Here now the 2-2. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Set to get his evening at the plate started. A Swan Vieira batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. Fastball here misses low and it's back to even now at 2-2. Two and two. Hit sharply but foul down the right side. That one drilled him. Thankfully, he's able to recover, and he gets the second out at first. Stepping up to the plate, Sam Huff. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. The 1-1. Fouled away. Swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Ready now, Lazaro Armenteros. He did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. 1-1. One, one. 
Hit on the ground out to short, right to him. And there's one down now. Now at the plate, Logan Davidson. He drove in the other of their two runs last night. The one two. Here's a swing and a high pop up. Drifting toward the third base dugout. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. Hey, that fastball caught too much of the plate on no two count. Here's a shot to left field and deep. Look at this. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Hey, every once in a while, this speed guy will jump up and bite one. He absolutely crushed that baseball. Doesn't fit his usual tool description. But he can go deep if you leave one over the heart of the plate. At the plate, Buddy Reed. Now this ball's hit deep to left field. And that is off the wall. Around second now, and they still haven't flagged this one down. And he's in there at third with a one-out triple. Into the box now, J.J. Schwartz. Out in front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Just out in front of that one, still two and two. A full count, three balls and two strikes. Now a big swing, and this ball is rushed out to deep center field. And off the batter's eye for a home run. An impressive shot to dead center field. And now, Marcos Brito. Inside and low, two and one. Well, I think he just kind of lost focus on the mound right there. It, it's clearly not going his way, and he's thinking more about that than the task at hand. And right now, he needs to think about this hitter. Try to hold back, but he won't be able to as that's ruled a swing, and there are two away now. Now batter. Digging in for his second at bat, Vimael Mashin. It was a fly out for him to start the home first. Line drive to left. Clark is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Stepping in, Leoti Tavares. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Fouled off. Base hit, and they're into the hit column. Got to get the third base hit. Ryan Dora. So now to the plate, Ryan Dora. Pitch inside the throw. It skips in and he's safe. Close play, but he's in there. Set to deliver on two and one. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. Now a ball hit in the air to straight away left. This is carrying well out of here. Hey, that wasn't a particularly good pitch right here. This guy doesn't get away with very many mistakes. He's going to have to do a better job pitching out of the middle part of the plate. Standing in now, Ladarius Clark. Not quick enough that time, and he's lucky to get another chance. Count remains full. Down the left field line and deep. And that's going to land foul. Too close for comfort, and he did a good job just to make contact.
hit hard on the ground towards second. Reined in on to first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. At the plate, Yoni Hernandez. So far, 0 for 1 with a fly out. And with his speed, he's one of those rare guys who you'd actually like to see keep the ball on the ground. You can't beat out a fly ball in this game. But right at the shortstop for the second out. Now Stepping up now, Eli White. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. 1-1. And he fouls this one off. Bases are empty here with two men out. Breaking ball misses the corner. Two balls and two strikes. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and break. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. with the play Dylan Thomas as we move on to the bottom of inning number three the one one is looked at for ball number two fastball and mm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here it's three and one George Merritt will be next sent in the air out to straightaway center Tavares is right there, one down. So striding forward now, George Merritt. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. No contact there, and it's 1 and 2. Sent on the ground out to second. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. At the plate now, Eric Peralta. He's fallen behind now, three and one. And this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. Now Into the box now, Lazaro Armenteros. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Oh, and he leaves another one over the plate, and this ball's driven to left. And for the third time tonight, he has served up a home run. At the plate, Logan Davidson. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Now batting. Stepping into the box, Buddy Reed. He scored after tripling in his first plate appearance. What's he got in store for us here? This one's down to third. And the throw is wide as it pulls the first baseman off the bag. So it's a runner at first as a result of the throwing error. And now it will be the catcher, J.J. Schwartz. Now a move over to first, and he'll dive back in. set here comes the 1 1 ground ball sent back up the middle it'll whip this one to first in time and that ends the inning new inning set to get underway and that'll bring up the outfielder Anthony Buck Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. Hit hard on the ground towards second, and that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. The first baseman, number one, Michael. Into the box, De Michael DeLeon. Rounded back up the middle. Oh, a diving effort as it's off his glove. And not really much of a chance to recover there as he'll reach first on what undoubtedly will be scored as an infield single. To the plate now, a Swan Vieira. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. 
as a look now the pitch and this one's in the dirt good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on three two pitch swing and there it goes deep to left no chance at bringing this one back gone and that one had some extra distance. So now to the plate, Sam Huff. Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. He takes the turn and heads for second. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Now back, the center fielder, Leody Tavares. Standing in now, Leody Tavares. And it's fouled away. One two is an off speed pitch no dice it's two and two. Yeah and if you get a guy flailing at a pitch like that heck you're going to go out there and throw that same pitch until he proves he can lay off of it. Swing and a miss and that's a much needed out first out there. Ryan Gore. The one two is a breaking ball that can't find the zone and it's even at two. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Left fielder is on the move. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. So stepping in, Ladarius Clark, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. The set and the 2 2. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So coming to the plate, Marcos Brito comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is aboard. Now Stepping in now, Vimael Mashi. Now a swing and a miss, and he's behind 1 and 2. Slap hard the opposite way. A leap, but he can't bring it down. Base hit. In now, Dylan Thomas. Line drive to left. That's in there. Base hit. And they'll quickly get it in here to hold that runner at third base. Edgar Arredondo answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from their starter. Into the box, George Merritt hit the target, but this is low, two and one. This is in the air out to straightaway center. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And he will score on the sacrifice fly. So here's the cleanup hitter, Eric Peralta. Eric Peralta. The 1-1. One, one. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. All even now, two and two. From the belt, the pitch. Now a swing and a ball foul tipped straight into the catcher's glove as he's able to hold on for the second out. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Lazaro Armenteros. Two men on, two away here in the fourth. And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Not a good spot to be in right now. A pitch has fallen behind in the count with a guy up that hits really well with runners in scoring position. Mushing on second. Thomas on at first with two down. 
And a foul tip here, but it's held on to for the out. Good work behind the plate, and the inning is over. James Nail, the six foot four inch right hander, comes in out of the bullpen to do the pitching. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Yoni Hernandez. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. This is on the ground over to first. He's right there, and he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. Digging in once again, Eli White. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Now the 2 1 pitch. Hit on the ground out to short. On to first, and there are two down. Ready for another chance. Anthony Buck, 1 for 2 on his line so far in the game. The 1 1. Lined hard toward right center. And that finds the outfield grass for a base hit. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. The first baseman, number one, Michael DeLeon. At the plate, Michael DeLeon. And that misses two and one. To short. Oh, and he can't come up with it. The batter, number 10. Get the needed hitter. Swan. Into the box now. A Swan Vieira. Now here's a comebacker back to the mound. And he'll flip this one on to first as he works his way out of the jam, and the inning is over. Into the box, Logan Davidson. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, but it was a good change up, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. On the year, Davidson carries a batting line a little over the 260 mark. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Fouled away. Ready with another 2 2. Change up taken for ball three, well below the zone. Pulled toward right center field. Long run for the right fielder. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. That plate, Buddy Reed. He'll swing it from the left side right here. Both teams with eight hits in this one. And that misses two and two. Hard on the ground towards short. Throw gets him, two down. Coming to the plate now, J.J. Schwartz. Perhaps he can drive another one out of the park just like he did back in the second. 1-1. One, one. On a line, that's a base hit. So he delivers with two away, and the bottom of the fifth marches on. Now back, second baseman, Marco. To the plate now, Marcos Brito. To two balls and two strikes now. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Left fielder giving chase. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and next to hit is the catcher, Sam Huff. 1-1. One, one. The knees for a called strike, and it's back to even at two and two. 
neither guy willing to give in and the at bat will continue. The 2 2 one more time. Is looked at and the count moves full. And in a two run game right here, you really don't want to walk the leadoff guy to start an inning. You've got to keep that tying run in the on deck circle as long as you can. Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Sam Huff goes down to become the first out in the sixth inning. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. That was kind of a gift to the hitter. He's up there probably thinking of protecting on two and two. But when you launch a ball that high out of the strike zone, it's obviously easy to take that one. Another payoff pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. Scooped up. Throw on to first. Two gone. Now riding in once again, Ryan Doro. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. 1-1 one, one home. Two balls, one strike. I count. One thing that can nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offensive prowess, but he's putting together a real nice at bat here. And that one's taken outside for a ball. They walked him. So no one, two, three inning here. They've got themselves a two out base runner. Now the one and one pitch. And they pitch out here, but nothing's going on. Two out with the man at first. There he goes toward second. Pitch outside. The throw way late, and he's in there easily at second. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back to back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Now batting. Digging in. Yoni Hernandez. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Vimael Machine. The 1 1 home. Two balls, two strikes. Pulled toward right center field. Tavares waits on it. One away. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Dylan Thomas. Last time through was a base hit. Fastball well outside. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. And here's a changeup in there for a called third strike. And that's the second out of the inning. Ready once again. George Merritt earned himself an RBI with a sack fly his last time at the plate. Lays off the change up and he's ahead in the count now three and one. Tried to crush that ball and now perhaps needs to shorten up with two strikes. He got the fastball where he wanted and just pulled off of it. Swing and a liner but pulled in at the hot corner and that ends the inning. Seventh inning ready to roll, and that'll bring in the second baseman, Eli White. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. Even count, two balls and two strikes. Pulled high in the air out to left field. 
Armenteros a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first down. The right fielder. Now at the plate, Anthony Buck Anthony. will try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Well, he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once an A.B., maybe once a game, maybe once a week. So he certainly capitalized on it last time. Fly ball out toward left center field. Reed calls off the left fielder as he takes charge for the second out. Digging in the switch hitter, Michael DeLeon. He's two for three thus far. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Good swing on a tough pitch, and he'll stick around to see another one. Count is full. Here's the pitch. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Blake Bass gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Digging in now, Eric Peralta. The 1 1 home. I got two one Big go. sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. Now Digging in, Lazaro Armenteros. He homered back in the third inning in this one. Takes this the other way to right. Buck is there, two down. Next will be the designated hitter, Logan Davidson. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Davidson. The 1-1. Misses ball two. Two out, nobody on. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And that'll get down out there near the wall. And he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Now back, center fielder, Buddy. At the plate now, Buddy Reed. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. Zach Irwin has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Striding in, a Swan Vieira. And if you remember, I'm sure he does, he hit a round tripper back in the fourth. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first down. Now batting, Sam Huff. He's working on a one for three thus far. Grounder down the line at third. But a foul ball, one and two now. The pitch. Got him. And that's the third time we've written a K next to his name in this one. How about Coming to the plate now, Leody Tavares. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase, and they can't run it down. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Digging in and looking for more, J.J. Schwartz. It was a single for him in his last at-bat. The 2-1 home. is laid off of for ball number three. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. And he'll step on first for the out, three unassisted. Now with the play, Marcos Brito. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. 3-2 pitch. 
And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Vimael Mashi. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. Almost got him to go around, but instead it's ball three. Grounded up the first baseline, but this will wind up foul as he runs the count full now. 3 2 pitch. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back to back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Standing in, Dylan Thomas. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, Maddie, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the. This ball gets down. Let's see if they try to score. As he arrives at second without a play, as also on the play, a run comes across to score. Jimmy Hergut is given the ball here to try to work out of a tough situation. Two runners in scoring position to deal with. Stepping in now, George Merritt. Right back to him, and it's off his shoe. And he'll get in there safely. So now to the plate, Eric Peralta hit in the air to shallow center. Coming in is Tavares. He makes the running play. Two down. And even with two outs now, they decide to hold that runner at third. Settling in now, Lazaro Armenteros. And with every base occupied, a big hit here could really put this one out of reach. Fastball, and hmm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Tavares waits on it. And they'll avoid the big inning as he makes the catch, so just the one run scores here in the frame. Ben Bracewell comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 64. Now to the plate, Ryan Dora comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. They look like they're up against it here, down three on the road, trying to come back against the closer. And he lays off the breaking ball there as he moves ahead to two and one. Ground ball right side. He's got it. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. At the plate, Ladarius Clark. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Now the 1 and 1 pitch is taken for ball two. Fouled off. The 2-2. Two -two. Heading out towards shallow right. Thomas is over just a few steps to his left as he takes it for route number two. Now in the box, Yoni Hernandez. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth. The 1 1 home. His fastball taken high for a ball. He would have had to go with the old school Tommy Hawk approach on that one if he wanted to get on top, but he was able to lay off it. Bases are empty here with two men out. This is pulled into right. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Success on a three and one count to keep the inning alive here. The second base, Eli. White. Standing in now, Eli White, and this is swung on and missed. So now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. A swing and a ground ball to third. On to first, and that's your ball game. It's always nice to give your fans at home something to cheer about, and they definitely did that right here, coming through with a big win at home. Eight to five tonight.
The Midland Rockhounds took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. James Nail wins in relief for the eighth time this year. Wes Benjamin allowed seven earned runs to cross the plate in the losing effort. Ben Bracewell closes the door for the save, his 31st of the campaign. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. From my partners Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show.